All right. Oops. Oops. That just randomly quit out of the game. All right, whatever. It takes like no time to get back in. So, uh, hey everyone, Wonderbots here, and welcome back to a robot named Fight. I played this on launch, loved it. YouTube didn't seem to care that much, but I did. And good. Okay, yeah. I played a little over a year ago. And then they gave me the Switch key, and I meant to play it, but I think we were like really busy at the time. Uh, and I've just been wanting to come back, and I was like, oh, this game has local co-op. Okay, I can... Hello. You know what? Got to the breeze. Let's not do that, actually. Let's let's go back. You mean you want to start? Let's, I'm going to start a new save. I'm going to start a new save game because part of it is I only have five episodes on YouTube, and that actually doesn't reflect the amount of progress oh, I've made in this loud. game. It is very loud. Let's turn that down. I'm going to have to turn it down off stream. Um, let's, see, let's see if I can. Ah. 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 Also, you probably don't want to show your window. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, there we go. But yeah, I think it's probably better that we just start over. Uh, I didn't want to start over because it would uh, it would uh, reset all of the upgrades that I've I've gotten. However, I think it's better that we do so just because stuff has changed. Uh, it's new patches and whatnot. Now, okay, it's actually going it's to be still a bit loud. Yeah. Can you change it in the settings as opposed to in your... Not really. There's only 10 sound settings and this game is baseline pretty loud. Okay. That should be a little bit better. That should be that should be fine. I think that's good. Alright. Uh, let's see. So this game is a combination between like Mega Man and Metroid. Mm -hmm. Mostly Metroid. Uh, the music just reminds me of Mega Man. Uh, so you want to press start? And you are, a a little, you are a little purple helper ball. So you just move and shoot. Uh, that's the only thing. You have to you shoot with the right stick. Right, right. But it looks like I, I just... Oh, I go back to you. Yeah, you have a, a button to teleport right back to me. But otherwise, learn how to... No, no. Right stick to shoot. So really? you can shoot that, in any that, direction. That's that? Yep, that's, that's it. it. Uh, Do so I take damage? No. You are you I'm are just a helper bot. Yes. You are invincible. Press X to shoot. A to... Uh, and he dies. Okay. Yep. So I'm I'm the one that actually has to do do work here. What am I? Then you'll do the platforming, and yeah. I'll be helper bot. Oh, you can pick up pickups for me. I can pick up pickups for you. Yes. That's good. That's lovely. I will be helper bot. You are already helper bot. And I'm purple, so I'm happy. Yep. So there are upgrades that we can get for you. Uh, so if you look at the top right, there's there's a little map. See the square? Yes. On the map, that means there's there's an item there. Also look for like cracked surfaces and stuff because that's how we traverse. But as helper bot, you are die, little gelatinous glob with only one ocular. So you can just fly organ. around, just wrecking things for me. Wait, oh. did I take damage? Oh, you might actually. So you might actually take damage for me. Oh, that doesn't sound good. It could. It could be a bit of a problem. Yeah. So what? Uh, shell ramming the spikes can hurt Wander. So, so I have to be more careful. I can't just... Yeah, you can't just rambo through fire and flames. Okay. Okay, there we go. Luckily, health is in pretty high supply in this game. You can also shoot enemy projectiles out of the air and... I actually know why this was up here. But yeah, it's... Bit of a shame that she's not invincible, but I kind of understand. Can you... I'm assuming I'm just supposed to kill these little yeah. buggers. At least I can... F ah! Sorry. At That's least fine. I can fly. Yep. It, it'll make things easier. This is this is a fairly... I'm not going to say an easy roguelike. I have died in it. Um, the bosses can be a bit tough. I want to actually kill those like weird flesh worms, because they're a lot harder for me to hit. There we go. Rain from above. Now, if I remember right, is there... Oh. Is there what? There's a... I think there's... No, maybe there's not. Uh, sometimes in these games, you can actually hold a button and you'll, like, hold, lock in place and shoot. But it doesn't look like that's the case in this one. Look at those little guys. They just have legs and teeth. Let's see. Are we oh, excited wait, for chip? Dragon Quest Builders 2? Yes, I am. And Shell, Shell should be. 
Oh, is that going to be multiplayer? It's is that going to be multiplayer, and you are probably going to join me on that one. I got to figure out what platform. Oh, right, right, right. I can't. I can't be near that one. Otherwise, the the little buggers come after you. Yeah. Whoa. Is that just like teeth and yeah, bristle and stuff flesh. rolling around? Uh, everything is tumors in this game. I it's, mean. Oh. Uh. You know, we want to go back a bit. Yeah. Oh, oh watch wow. out for the spikes. There we go. So, there's an item in this room somewhere. Okay, well, we will find it. We might not be able to find it immediately, but there's, um... You can actually, uh... There's secret, uh, like, secret rooms, passages, doors, so on and so forth all over the place. Uh, mm -hmm. so we want to just look. Maybe here? Oh, there it is. Found it. See that? Oh, yeah. You got a green archaic scrap. Can be donated to... Shrines? Yep, and forged, and forged by, by allies. allies. Yeah, so we can use, uh, we can buy upgrades oops, now. Oops, 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 sorry. It's fine. There we go. It's coming so out this on... Is, this is one of those things where it respawns every time you leave. Yeah, yeah, so the enemies respawn endlessly. Oh, but that actually means, uh, if you're in, like, a safe area, you can farm for the, the money system. Uh, you can also form... Okay, another secret in here if you check the map. Ah. A couple of secrets. This one leads up, but there's there's another thing. Ow. Watch out for the flesh boobs. Is that look out for the flesh boobs? Bloobs. Okay. I don't know how to find some of the secrets. It's easier, uh, so we don't want to actually go through that door yet. We're still oh. looking for... Oh, this is where we came from. Yeah, so just run around shooting the walls for a while. Oh. You got an attack module, ready to fire up. Yep, so it was just it was kind just of sitting below around us. here. Yeah, unfortunately the secrets are just kind of uh, randomly-ish placed. And you kind of have to just run around and shooting. It's a lot easier when... Um... Oh. Energy orb has been unearthed and will appear in future playthroughs. It's not just an orb, it's a vorb. Yeah, so that's uh, that's a playable character for you, effectively. Void orb. Yep. Oh, wait, so that means I could be some kind of spatial anomaly? Yeah, there's a, there's a couple of different anomaly. orbs that you can be. Ah. All right. well, I shouldn't be here. I nope. should just let you shoot them. Fine. Instead I'll, of... I'll shoot the, the teeth in a barrel. Yep, ready That's for a boss are. fight? Wait, this is the boss, boss door? fight? Or not. What? What is this? Tear. What have you brought to Tear? Oh. This so is it's a, a shrine. This is the shrine to shrine to Tyr. He is potentially isn't, one isn't of the mechanical Tyr gods. Isn't Tyr a Norse god? I yes. So shrines are a new mechanic. I don't know what they do. Oh right. I'll just let you handle him. Wait. Now, when they explode into little flesh blobs, do those exploding flesh blobs actually cause damage no. to you? No. Okay. They're just. It was a worm that hurt me. It was like a little. Uh, Tear is the guy that Tuesday. Oh yeah, Tear's Day. Uh, Tuesday was named after. And him. then thir Thursday is Thor. Yep. Monday is just Moon Day. Yep. And Sunday is just Sunday. And August is an asshole. Did you ever That's hear a month. about that? July and August are actually just Julius and Augustus. Yeah. And oh, Oct can't get through here. I mean. October isn't necessarily for Octavius. Oct means eighth. So that means at one point it was the eighth month of the year rather than the tenth. And then I think Julius and Augustus. Yeah, probably squeezed Julius and Augustus. Were well, like Augustus squeezed themselves themself in, and yeah, because yeah, Sept is seven. Nov is ninth. Des. Okay, no would be ten here. for Deca, and then yeah. Now the reason why ah, here we go. January is called January is because it's derived from Yanua, which means doorway, like Yanis, the god with two faces, and he's supposed to look forward and back for time. So that's why the turn of the year is January. Eh. 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 Okay, there we go. Line ah. gray tentacles. I did not know how these little 
munchy caterpillars are levitating. Uh, no! Oh, did we leave? Yeah. Sorry. Okay, here. Oh, I, I, I made the mistake. So let's just go this way. Ooh, this is different. It was like a flying drake. Yep. That. I think they're fairly weak. Apart from flying into, they might shoot down. I could be wrong. Well, more little toothy critters. Oh. What are those? Oh. Just oh, doors? you have electric shots too. Oh, because of you. Yeah, so you can open up electric doors. That's awesome. And also zap monsters. Also, ah, what? look out the window. Oh, what? It's just tentacles. Yeah. I'm... Extensions of Get... the That's mother normal. thing. That is actually normal for this game. <laughs> Look at that thing. That must have been quite the pixel work. I mean... Whoa, man. Speaking of... Speaking of actually... eyes below mouths... <laughs> I'll shoot it. It's back. Okay. It's release. Oh, gross. So it's actually releasing those worm things from those pulsating sacks on its back. Yep. Don't actually... No. Ow. Can I, am I actually doing damage? Yeah, to no, it? you are. You are hurting him way more than not, uh, I'm hurting him. There we go. Da, 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 okay, auto turret has been unearthed and will appear in future playthroughs. I'm enjoying this, and you seem to be too. Yeah. It is our prerogative to vanquish the giant, Poor fleshy abomination that currently resides in our atmosphere. Though. What are they protecting? Is this just a machine oh, world? Yeah. That By the way, you can see the boss in the background. Well, I mean, this is the big thing. Yeah, that's the boss. Well, so... Ah, mouse. So, what I'm wondering is, is this a machine world that's just devoid of organics? Uh, and, yes and no. Or have all of the they, humans that built the robots okay, since perished and been added to the giant so there muck is, monster. There, there is an area later in the game that actually explains this. It's a roguelike with a bit of environmental storytelling, which I really appreciate. I like that. It's not too much. I think it gets like mouths, more storytelling as we monsters. go along. I could be wrong. But yeah, there, there's one area and I think a boss, maybe not a boss, where it's like kind of obvious what happens. Or maybe there's lo logs or something. I I don't remember, but I the story is actually like relative, rel eh, relatively, relatively <laughs> like self-explanatory. Once you can't get through. No, nah, I just have to shoot down. Right, shell has been unearthed. Yeah. So um, you know how when we were playing Vile, oh, I guess went into return. Well, that's fine. This is the boss room. No, we just um. You can't jump to many of the, these side corridors. Yeah, so after a certain point in this game, it gives you kind of a point of no return that you can't get back from. Mm -hmm. So notice how there's the door we came through is up there. Yes. We need super jump to get back. So does this mean you have to die, or can you actually get the upgrade that you need to escape? Uh, We have to come back later, effectively. Okay, because I'm wondering if someone could play, like, win this in one playthrough. Yes, Uh, sort of. So it's it's a roguelike. So every time we, uh... Every time you die... Every time we die, it's a new run. Yeah, uh, wait, oh? Oh. Because yeah. I thought that in order to get new abilities, you have to usually perish yeah, so, in order to... Yeah, so effectively... Oh, it's are you beatable. looking for a specific door? Yeah, there's... No, 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 there's, uh, there's a secret. There you go. Got it. Energy module. Um, but it, the game provides you everything you need to win on every single run. It's, it's very well designed. The Ooh, only... Mushroom. Or the mushroom isn't okay. Yeah, the only caveat is uh, we won't have all of the like the really cool upgrades. So, for example, we got the bright shell and the auto turret and stuff. Mm -hmm. Those are uh, those are upgrades that will appear in oh, future Oh, those runs. are mouths. Yeah, can't kill those. Oh. Yeah, I just got to jump over them. And those are fleshy spikes. Uh, so, run number one is not going to Ew, is, is just... not going to resemble run number two. Do you know what was gross about that? Four? What the first thing I thought of that turret because it was like chucking out brown slime. I thought it, I was going to call it the pooper. I mean, you might as well. It must be amusing coming up with names for all these creatures. Okay, so watch out these these spikes are actually dangerous. The ones on the ceiling. Yeah. I think they can fall and hit you. Oh, yeah, that spike right there. It has an eyeball on it. Ah! 
Yeah, they're... They kind of suck, though. They're not actually dangerous. Okay, so we're looking for a secret in the area? Okay. So just start freaking out and shooting the walls. Uh... You'll find it eventually. Oh, wait, wait, this is... Yeah, you got it. This? Ah, shame you can't pick it up. Got a speed module. Speed up. Let's just go up from here. Never mind. Oh, was, was that a boss room or something? That we'd already... Uh... Uh... There we go. Can uh, I damage these? Yeah, I can. So, like all Metroidvanias, this game has, like, impassable locations that you straight up can't get through until you have the appropriate upgrade. Yes. Uh -oh. And so, in that case, it was... It was an area that... You uh, need was, a different beam? Uh, a beam, an upgrade, something. Okay. Can you grab those health pickups? Uh, yes. Because we are... We are in mild amounts of danger. And I want to live. Really? Your health looks fine. We had 3 HP earlier. Oh, okay. okay. Wait, is that a fly? Hello, organism that does not belong to the giant monstrosity. But it could be a sky. little robot fly. Oh, hey. Oh, robot fly. Artificer. I can forge items like no other. Just bring me the scrap so we can get an F chip and a tractor helm. Power pauldrons. And I don't actually know what the F chip does. No, I know exactly what the F chip does. I mean, it costs the most. It must be important. Yep. F chip is amazing, if I remember right. Hold Y to activate. Okay, and we should be able to get the attractor helm. So it increases pickup range. Okay. So, the F chip, if I press Y, yep. heals me. Ooh. I have a little healing device, which is amazing. Oh, so I wonder if an F chip is like an ether chip? Do these things run off of some kind of magic? Uh, so if you notice, I've got that little energy meter there in the yeah. top left? Yes. That's the energy. Okay. We have thanked the necessary people. Thank you so much. Now let us go. Alright. Sorry, yeah, blobs. So, so the F chip is not the end-all be-all uh, yes. upgrade, but it means that we can be a little bit braver because uh, I we just auto-heal. Well, sort of. Mm -hmm. I think there's like an upgraded version with like a better conversion rate or something. I don't entirely remember. Oops. Uh, but it's it's real helpful in a in a boss fight because I can effectively use my uh, my health bar as an alternate. Oh, secret! Start shooting. Yeah, there was something around here. Got it. Yeah, usually the secrets aren't just uh, the secrets are actually like oh that was a well mouth marked. thing. Yeah, if I go fast, oh god, Ouch. puke beams. There's a worm. Coming I think for there's you. like an up. Is it an upgrade for the F chip? There's a something for the F chip. Watch that out for those mouths. Makes I don't it like better. Them. All right. Uh, this is probably the secret right there. Yeah. yeah. Shot speed module. Lost. There we go. Uh, so by the way, try try charging up your shot. Press and hold the button. Oh. Oh wait, no, no, no. You're a stick, so you can't. I'm a stick. <laughs> yeah, you, you can't actually press and hold. Anything. I mean, I haven't tried any other buttons. Because I can, uh, I can actually charge up my my lightning shot. No, I I can't. I don't. I only have one shot. I'm just a helper bot. Oh, that's fine. Because you are actually quite helpful. There we go. That requires fire. Oh no 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 no. Whoa! We we need a heat shield. Yeah. So there's there's heat armor that we can get slightly later on. That'll make this easier. Okay. So there's a secret in here. Usually, it's usually some. Oh, there we go. Yeah, there it is. Yeah. So scrap. More scrap. Yep. So that'll get us the power pauldrons if we go back to that guy. Ow. Woo. I don't actually. Yeah. Watch that you don't ram the dude. Sorry. It's fine. Because yeah, the reason Whoa. why I wanted to see if you could charge it up. Oh, because is so you, you just annihilated that yeah, entire exactly. room. Yeah, exactly. Lightning. Lightning is both like a blessing and a curse. 
as far as like oh, uh, upgrades oh, go. Barfs. Yeah, barf monster. Oh, oh. and worms. Ow. Now the worms can hover up from other areas. Yeah, they can fly through the environment. There's a couple of upgrades that uh, bypass that. Anyways, I want to bring us... Oh, wait, no, no, no. We need more scrap, I think. So I can't do. It's a little disorienting how the camera follows your jumps. Yeah, I apologize for that. Don't need heat shield. It's just incredibly useful. Oh, right. All right, because there are those... And the camera, I think, does mildly eyes. follow you. It will shift based on your positioning. I think it's more dependent on your, you jumping. Yeah, it probably is. For the most part, it's fixed perspective in rooms, but some some rooms it'll move. The ones that have more verticality to them. Oh, watch out. Yeah, those are the ones with the... Whoa! The faces. We're mostly good. There we go. Guess we took a little bit of damage. That's fine. Watch out. Yep, because oh. they're those guys that come out of the ceiling. I forgot about them. Luckily, they don't do that much damage. Still, they munch on you. It's true. It's best not to get munched. But yeah, I like the uh, I like the lightning upgrade. It's real helpful. It also kind of sucks a little bit sometimes because it's like uh, there are certain like rapid shot upgrades Ooh, that you what's, can get. What's up with that goop? Is it covering one yeah, of the holes? Yeah, we need like fire or something. You need something in order to. Where is the fire upgrade? Maybe acid or something to melt through that organic huh. matter. Okay. Come on, I can hit this guy. I guess we could just save up for the power pauldrons. Okay. Grab the goodies. Why did they disappear? Why did they have to go away? I thought I heard a beeping sound. Uh, the beeping is me, uh, me re recharging our health with the eth chip. Oosh. Man, getting the F chip on our first run is actually going to make this so much easier. Mm -hmm. I feel like they made uh, some of the tankier enemies easier, but it could just be our combined firepower or something. Our firepower combined! Because uh, those, those guys with the horns on their backs used to be a real nuisance. Let's try going up. Okay. Oh. You just blast through it. I feel foolish. Ooh. Okay. Is that a new weapon? A yeah. flamethrower. Oh, no. What? Uh. What? 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 Now we can go through that lower area? Sort of. The flamethrower sucks. D it doesn't replace what you currently no. have, though. You can choose to use it. Yeah. It, it is something that I, I actively get oh, to Oh, watch choose. out for the eyeball. Yeah. Stalactites. So the reason why I don't like the flamethrower that much is it's not that efficient. It burns through your energy in, like, no time flat. And, uh... Let's see. Do we have enough? I think we have enough. Um, but the flame... So the flamethrower is kind of mediocre just because there's a there's an upgrade uh, called Flame Shot. Mm -hmm. Which just set your attacks on fire. Which is incredibly useful. Okay. So now we have Power Pauldrons. Energy regen increased. Oh! And now he says he's done all he can. Yep. So I guess we just have... Yeah, our energy just ticks back up over time. Hey, so we don't have to necessarily oh. collect those yellow orbs as often. Yeah, and they're pretty plentiful, but that means that, like, we should never not be full health. And full energy. That's convenient. And that actually makes the flamethrower much less suck. Because, yeah, the, the main problem with the flamethrower was... Uh, it burns through energy burst? real quick. Okay. And uh, it didn't really like provide that um, that much immediate damage. Well, will the flamethrower be the key to getting through that one area? Oh. Oh wait, this is a red zone. See? It's. Oh, that requires rockets. Mm-hmm. It's it's been a while since I've played this. Okay, but this will get us through the uh, the flesh zone. The flesh zone. Into the flesh wall. Through the flesh. 
Oh god, the flesh zone sounds like a really weird, like, uh, burlesque dancing uh -huh. place. Welcome to the flesh zone. I trust that you, uh, enjoyed your stay. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> now, I'm trying to think of some of the most grotesque body horrors I've ever seen. I mean, people always bring up the one from the 1980s, the thing. Those are pretty gross. I, a lot of video games have been doing that's because they looked Dead human. Space. Dead well, Space does some hella body horror. Well, that's horror. the thing. The Dead Space's aliens actually resemble the, um... Well, not aliens. I suppose they were once people, but... Yeah, ne they necromorphs are just, like, modified people. Uh, right, but, oh, they, but they very much resemble the body second. horror of the 1980s, the thing. Because the 1950s, the thing, was a, a plant person that uh, you barely is. saw, and he looked sort of like Frankenstein monster at the very end. Human centipede. Oh, God, don't remind oh, me of that Oh, no, movie. no. I've heard about that, and I would never want to see that it. Whoa, it that whole good. ceiling is covered in mouths. Oh, boss time. <gasps> oh, no, it's because a Metroid bug. Because it has three eyes, three optics. Now, he will be shooting at you. Yep. However, I will be healing you. Whoa, whoa! Watch it, watch it, don't take too much damage. Okay. We don't have that much HP. Well, let's just rain of fire him. Yep, he did. There he goes. Thank you, F Chip. Hover Boots has been un unearthed and will appear in future playthroughs. Sweet. I'm hoping we can get uh, an HP upgrade or two. Ah, uh, we got the rocket launcher. Hey, so, but that means we can get through that rocket door. Yeah. Uh, the main reason why I'm just disappointed is every once can, in a while you'll get Are we going to try to go through the other side? Of there? Yeah. No, there's not. If there's you check the map, uh, doors are very obviously marked. Oh, let's run through this. Yep. Resident Evil has a lot of body horror things, too. Yeah. I was, I was watching some Resident Evil 4? 5 cutscenes, and it was just like, eh. <laughs> Someday, uh, oh. we should figure out when the Resident Evil 2 remaster is coming out. Because I wouldn't mind, like, kind of low-key going through, like... I've played both of the uh, campaigns of the Nintendo 64 Resident Evil 2. Yeah, because I wouldn't mind playing through Resident Evil 1 and 2. Because you can play as Leon and Claire. But guess what it means? You'll be hearing Matt Mercer. Oh. He voices Leon S. Kennedy. I don't know if he did so for the Nintendo 64 one. That might have been before everything. Time? Was yeah. the N64 one even voice acted, though? Or yeah, there was some, I think. Was, Leon wasn't even in the N64 ones. Yes, yes, yes. He was? He was oh, in Resident right. Evil 2. Yeah, he was one of the two playable characters. You could be him or Claire Redfield. Well, I can't imagine he wouldn't reprise his role. I, he was in, He was Leon in 4. It was and, Leon in 4, and then the in 6. And Dark Side Chronicles. And in Dark Side Chronicles, and that movie, there was the... Was oh yeah, it? there was the animated movie. Yeah, there was the animated movie. Wasn't the animated movie just a recap of all of the old games? Uh, or no, 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 that was Dark Side Chronicles. Yeah, was. that was Dark Side Chronicles. There was also Umbrella Chronicles, I think, which was the other light gun shooter. But we never got very far in that one. But I didn't like it as much as Dark Side. Did the ver did the thing we pick up actually have both, or does it just have Dark Side? Chronicles? I think it just has Dark Side Chronicles. Ah, dang. I don't think they ever packaged them together, did they? No, they probably didn't. I should see if uh, it's cheap on Amazon or something. Oh, um, something we need to find in here. Oh, what are these orbs? Uh, those orbs were switches. Okay. Okay, flamethrower is better. Now that there's energy regen, it's not it's not nearly as uh, hateable of an item. Give me a second. Uh, oh, how do you get through the door? Flamethrower up above. Oh, okay. Yeah, with the energy regen, flamethrower does not suck. If you notice, the pips come back pretty quick, too. Uh... I always hated the flamethrower because your and I think initially your energy didn't come back, and so it's just like, well, I could use this weapon, or I could save it for healing. How your energy else. is just keeps ramping up because yep. we keep getting energy modules. Yeah, we haven't been getting any HP ups though. No, we haven't. 
Sucks a bit. The what's with the upper room here? There's nothing in this room. Weird. You would expect there would be because there's an elevator. Railgun has been unearthed and will appear in future playthroughs. Ooh, another mouth monster. Ow, ow. Damage. Now what are these? They just shoot lasers? Oh, yeah, watch it. They shoot fairly quick uh, projectiles. Mm hmm So don't... Sorry, I just held yeah. her back to you because you left. Watch our HP a bit. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to watch stay out. away because this guy is actually killing well, us. Well, I'll go up and back and forth up there. I got him. Yeah, this is probably the hardest area in the game. Okay. Uh, there's some other areas that are riskier, but this is the area where... Uh, any special Yeah, there's locations. one right here. There it is. Oh, that that's Help what up. we need. Yeah, because this is the area where the enemies get a little tougher, but don't have... Um, and we don't have all the HP upgrades or armor that we need to survive. Look at those little guys. They have little eye... Whoa, never mind. Okay, HP is doing okay. Yep, there's just that guy over there with the... Got him. Yep. Okay, now I like the flamethrower. It does not suck as much as it used to. It used to be real bad. There it is. Oh, another health up. Yep. But yeah, once we start getting a couple of the health upgrades, it's this game gets so much easier. Okay. Still anything? looking for a secret. Secret. Wait, what's that? There was another block up there. One second. Where? It was like here, but not quite. Oh. No, that doesn't seem like it. Oh, oh. it's this one. Yeah, it's that. It's right here. Right there. Okay. Red archaic scrap. That's the one I had seen. Yep. Let's see. Do we get more energy drops when using the flamethrower? So this game does, uh... Oh. Ah! Oh, ah. what are those? Missile launchers? Yeah, missile drones. Uh, it's fine. We've got this. Uh... Is, oh, are you trying here. to find another one? Yeah, it's up. It's right there. Really? So I'm not, not getting okay. it. Okay. Other side, maybe? It's usually, like, there's usually, like, some kind of visual... There bit. we go. There we go. Blue scrap. There's usually, like, a visual bit that it signifies, like, there's uh -oh. a thing here. This place is, like, one of those under quarantine. Well, I'm going to have to teleport to you to figure out where we That's are. Fine. Okay. okay, we got rid of that one. But yeah, this game is... Oh, there it is. Shot speed module. Uh, this game gives you more energy based on, like, how much you have. So if you only have a little bit left, it'll give you more. So if I'm flagrantly wasteful by using the flame... Oh, there's the a healer, scrap pile of, of guys. Whoa, okay. worm. Okay. Worm, 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 worm. No, thank you. There we go. Do you know what those little guys with the multiple eyes look like? What? They almost look like grotesque horror versions of the flying buds. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, kinda. Alright. I love the flying buds. Look around for... Flying uh, was a really cute game. It was a cute game. And I guarantee you, like, 90% of people uh, watching this video have never even seen, a, seen or heard of the game. Oh, there we go. I found you it. You got it. Hey, sweet... That was a fun series. Can we get out of here? Because I my uh, eyes are going to go mad. Actually, is that a human face in the background? Yes. It's a, uh, that is either one of the machine gods or like a, a totem to one. Mm-hmm. There we go. Ah, uh, horror monsters. There we go. Plenty of HP. Now uh, what's up with these walls? Well, Get out of the spikes. I'm trying. It's not as easy. Okay. okay, I'll get health. You got it? Perfect. I'll heal us back up as well. I'll get more energy. Oh. Unfortunately, we want to go back up here. But yeah, this area is going to be just a little bit flickery. 
I okay. never really liked that a strobing lot effect. It's n it's not consistent. This area is not always flickery stroby. There's there's something around here. Okay. I thought this was going to be easier with the flamethrower, but I don't think so. So I might as well heal up. Maybe it's... on this? Oh, there it is. It's right there. Oh, on up the right? here? Yeah, I think so. Well, let me... you have to come up again. Yeah. No? No, not there. Doesn't look like it. Makes you want to see Wander play Super Metroid. I wouldn't mind playing some of the, the Metroid games someday. Oh, there we go. There I it found is. it. Found it. It's worse it's worse when it's on the floor because I have trouble uh I have trouble reaching the floor. Okay, let's start top to bottom. Yeah, can you even aim at the floor? I can, but I have to jump. Which is not so easy. Eyes. Oh I could actually shoot the projectile out from in front yeah. of me. Oh, that's nice. Uh can't get through here. We need the double jump or something. I think, um, actually, we might even get the infinite jump. Infinite jump? Sounds yeah, there's like an flying. There's an infinite jump you can get where you just can jump forever. It trivializes certain boss fights, but awkward in others. Ooh, is this oh, the heat yep, room? Yep, heat room. Would be tough, but we're probably within a short walk of uh, getting the, the heat module. Okay, screw it. There we go. Neat. Uh, yeah, we've got to upgrade somewhere in here, though. That might actually be it over here. Got the green arcade? Yep. yep. Okay. But yeah, I'd like to play Super Metroid someday. Uh, main thing is I'm going to be playing Symphony of the Night tonight? Wait, really? Yeah. Uh, end of the stream, I think, is when Symphony of the Night's uh, PS4 port, port comes out. Oh, so Castlevania. Yeah. Aren't they also releasing the next season of the anime? Yeah. I, I'm pretty sure they're trying to do, like, a tie-in. There it is. Nothing but speed modules. Weird. Now, is that for running speed? Yeah, it's, it's running speed. There is such it's, thing as being too swift. It, it, there is. I've had that happen in this game. Oh, that is nice. So beyond the... Uh, Beyond the, uh... Yeah, you can shoot the missiles out of the sky, too. Mm -hmm. Uh, beyond just, like, the little speed upgrades that we've been getting, you can get a permanent speed boost. Oh, it's boots! Double jump. Double jump! Uh, you can get a permanent speed boost that makes you, like, hellaciously fast on top of everything. It's real awkward. Uh, I've had it happen a couple of times, and it's just like, oh, stupid flies. Can't hit these guys. Can't hit the flies. Okay. Luckily, we've got uh, an insane ability to self heal health. at all times. It's so nice. And twice the firepower. Well, maybe not twice. I probably count for less. Because but... you still actually get a drone, uh, even if you're playing solo, but it only shoots occasionally. Right. Let's see, it's... isn't Symphony of the Night already ported for the PS4? Might be? I heard it was like, maybe it's like a combo pack or something, I don't know. This room is danger. I know, it's full of gelatinous blob critters with we're still so many health. mouths. Okay, let's get out of here. We also luckily don't have to go this direction ever again. Because that is... We already found all the secrets. There we go. So we should be able to get through here? Yeah. Sorry, the camera is so locked to me. Yeah, it does make navigating a tad difficult. Can be a little bit bewildering. There we go. That's a bit annoying, but like, okay, oh, hey. so I can't home. It's a little elevator. Oh, but you have also all of those laser, laser men. Yeah, just remember to move occasionally. Yep. Because the enemies, you're not too hittable, but you are still quite hittable. 
But yeah, there might actually already be a uh, Symphony of the Night port for the PS4. I don't know. Oh, I was fighting, for, uh, firing for no reason. I thought there were more up the hill. <gasps> ah! Hello. That is Orbulon, <laughs> the eye benator. Oh, it has little guys coming yep. out too. Yeah. So this guy, this guy's an interesting problem. Uh. He's actually one of the easiest and the hardest bosses in the game. Uh, if, you oh, do too come on. if you do too much damage to him in too short of a time, he yeah. actually becomes like ridiculously hard to kill. Is it because of all the little things? Yeah. Effect Does he get smaller over time? I don't actually know if he gets smaller. Maybe it's not this boss. There's there's a boss at one point, and maybe it's this guy, or maybe it's the other non-eyeball version. There's one where he effectively... I keep getting hit. I should probably hide behind something and just help take out the little yeah, guys for you. Help take out. Because there's there's no rush. Remember, my, my energy... Oh, hey, 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 hey. You are dodging into every one of his hits. It's because I was hiding behind this and it turned out that that wasn't actually a viable option. It, it was. I think his shots were just going around. Okay, now he's split. Yeah, he's split. I'm just, I'm just hanging out over here healing slow. But yeah, th this is this is absolutely the uh, the dangerous version because oh. he can effectively split into a goofy amount of dudes, <laughs> and it's chaos. It's, chaos. It is pure chaos. Yeah, I'm just I'm just hanging out over here, shooting. We need to take out those those which ones? Eye shooter guys. Where are they? Uh, they're the ones with the blue eye. Those things. Okay. I see see them. them. Got one of them. Yep. Okay, watch it. Be very careful. We are we are losing some HP here. Okay. Yeah, you're taking a lot of hits. Sorry. I'm just gonna hang out over here. Do you want to recoup your energy? Is that yeah, what you're doing? Yeah, that's that's kind of my goal. Remember, you can also shoot the shots out of the sky. Okay, sure. I'll help shoot shots. Oh, I remember why I hate hated lightning. Mm -hmm. Uh, if my charge shot intercepts one of their shots. It seems oddly quiet. Yeah, we've killed almost all of them. There it goes. Lightning gun has been unearthed and will appear in future playthroughs. Uh, what was I gonna say? Uh, if my lightning shots get intercepted by, uh, just a regular shots, mm -hmm. I just do... Uh, sorry. Ah, heat shell. Yep. This is the hot room. Yep, survival. That's good. So effectively, if my shot hits another enemy shot, they they cancel each other. Even if I've been, you know, it's a fully charged shot, and it's like, no. Oh, I it's see. It's a wasted shot. So you're expending Cause, it. Yeah, because my shots will normally pass through enemies and stuff, which Ooh, is awesome. Ooh, what's this thing? Okay, so these are shrines. They will give us high tier items for scrap sacrifices. Uh, so the more scrap we give them, the better the item is. So, I'm not actually going to do it. It'd be cool. I'd love to get it. But, um... I figure we'll do that at the end, right before the boss. Ish. Instead of anything else. There we go. Oh, right. That's the other benefit of... The uh, heat shell, it actually gives me, like, contact damage. Oh. So if I take damage, I explode and hit everything nearby. It's not actually that helpful. Uh oh, here's another one of the strobing areas. Yeah. It's just this section. We've already beat the boss in this area, so apart from the one little effect bit of that I like about strobing, and I've seen this a lot, I suppose it's appropriate for the season. Uh, the fact. Wait, is that a robot that has something growing off of it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, Ooh. we are looking for a secret in here. Secret. There we go. You got it. Uh, I wish you could pick these up. Looks like you'll have to. There, there we go. go. Tech module. Way to fire up. Oh, it's already dead. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, luckily it does not look like we'll have to come back through here very often. Yeah, but I remember, um, what was it? They had, like, haunted mazes and such, and they would occasionally use strobe lights, and it, strobe lights are amusing in that because it's short bursts of light followed by darkness, you, it looks like people are in still frames. Yeah. But at 
different points of movement, like it goes faster than what it would be. So it it's creepy because you don't see the interim movements. Yeah. Little well, sort of jumping dead. ant creature. A little little uh, jumpy doggo thing. We did it. We did it. And it look it there's like a little genetic helix. So and there's a bunch of human bones. Is that a human? Yeah, that's a human. Did we kill it? Yeah. I mean, he's throwing nonstop Molotovs. Dude, uh... Can we go down to the... I wanted to look second. at the pit. We'll check it in a bit. I just wanted to grab this upgrade. Because we're going down there next. There we go. Okay, okay. It doesn't look so like there's anything else. We so. have... Just piles of human bones. Yep. And yeah, so I, I think they made this creature. Humanity. Humanity made, this made the robots. They got skynetted, and oh, Buzz Orb has been unearthed and will appear in future playthroughs. Wait, did they get skynetted and then make a organic horror monster? Yeah, they summoned an organic horror monster. Uh, shell. Oh, sorry. Yeah, watch out for contact damage. I didn't, sometimes I can't tell where I am. There we go. Because yeah, you take damage per tick. That's a cool there spin move. Well, it's just me jumping. I know. But it's uh, great for finding secrets. Yep, there's once again the little helix. Yeah, the weird... Weird helix. We know. Buggos. They really like to Buggos dart. Are, yep. Buggos are really annoying. So much easier when you actually have another person just kind of shooting them for you. Okay. Ah, Whoa! Ah, ah. It's a Metroid, isn't it? Like Pretty it much. grabbed onto your head. Oh right. Oh, it's a Molotov guy. I've got double jump. What am I doing? I gotta stop forgetting that I've got a double jump. Okay. So we want to go up, and we get. Big Ooh. HP up. Ooh, health tank. 